like this a lot. Dun dun dun. Dual Dorks is rocking his new heavy duty equipment. Rubber band to secure everything down. Hey, yeah. Double boost <laughs> uh. Alright, well, we've got Dual Dorks out front and uh, we're gonna scoop these guys up and we're gonna go down and scoop up the other guys and then we're gonna go to Eureka. It's gonna be a little bit of a road trip kind of a day today. Not really a road trip. We're gonna go all dirt. But we're all gonna go. And we'll go at it from there. Oh yeah, look at the fire over there. Holy heck. Guess I should have put my goggles on because this little trail is a little dusty. We is going T dubbing. Do, 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 do. <laughs> he is camo kitted out. I'm digging it. Look at that action, man. Save the tape. We're gonna scoop up these other guys. All right, we got two of them in front of us. Got a whole string of them back here behind us, and uh, we're gonna ride to Eureka today, a little ghost town. And check it out. So it should be fun. Should be fun. Cool meeting up with all these guys. Like none of them I've met before in person. Uh, a few of them just uh, online, and uh, we're to see a couple of them with the uh, Tito Club stickers out there. Put some patches off on the guys from New York and Michigan and out there. So yeah, man, look at this beautiful scenery. Woo-wee! All right.
kidding me? Laid back! Look at this beautiful territory. Where does that go? Oh, the money shot! <laughs> Get it, Dustin! here with some uh, heavy water hanging in it all gray all right see so we just needed to get out of uh, the little Moab little rock situation and uh, get out here and uh, see some of this backcountry this is actually really beautiful and a nice road
this little mountain. Down the hill, we'll be going into town from here. That's okay. He was trying to figure out what the hell was going on and slow down for us. like the old highway here <laughs> it's crazy we were all getting ready to pull out and he pulled out onto the road chain popped off UPS truck was making his way up the big long grade I'm like oh man it was like cats scattered every which way but uh yep yeah. day in the life of T-Dubbin Dear old 87 T-Dub here, the key 
is uh, the tumbler actually. The key is still the key is working, but it's in order to fill up splash. his tank, he's got to uh, pull his key out to fill up the tank. Now his key doesn't want to turn the tumblers. So we're uh, flushing out 30 something plus years of crust and dust. And... There we go. There. Yeah. Gotcha. I don't know why. Yes. You're on. good, man. Break dust <laughs> and lube. <laughs> out here, and this comes off and it has these two little tabs that or like one right here and that's what the key so you take that off take that piece out throw it away put that back on put the phillips screw and you don't even know it all you're doing is removing a, yeah, a little tab all right we're in eureka here and uh going to go check out some of this stuff there's a schoolhouse up here that says we can get to it Apparently that little bypass is closed, so we'll see. Look at the leaves are turning already. Whew. Fall is coming. when they got rain but they got some rain here recently because the uh, ground has some nice tack to it but uh yeah I'm gonna go check out the uh, yellow tractor mine Look at those mountains back there. So that's Provo area back there. Uh, so this area is pretty cool. I mean, California has its uh, desert connecting the mountains, you know, but. Somehow this is a, a little bit different. It's like more of the mountainous trees. We're in a little aspen grove back there and then you come back around over here. Here's some old... There's lots of mining activity but down in here.
far. All right, I'm dropping in on this little side route. The, <laughs> the navigation to it sent me all the way up to the top and uh, I guess it said something about having a little hike over to it but the hike was like 300 foot down and it was going down an old uh, 4x4 uh, like straight shot hill climb and I'm like well this is open there's no signs and look at this lovely section of trees right here and this drives right down to it so why not take the more uh, classical route TVs and stuff have definitely been coming down through here keeping it somewhat beaten out but, but the amount of rocks here don't look like they've been down here in a while. <laughs> the tractor. <laughs> Got some good asbestos you can play with. Yeah.
High air pressure in the front tire is uh, working against me today. <sighs> Being lazy though. My fault. Wait for Dustin to come up and then we'll head down. 